And something that has benefited us has been the President's Executive Orders on Immigration, you know, DACA and ALPA. Uh, I wanted to know what your stances are on those, you know, because right now it seems that you know, the Republican candidates for president have pledged to undo those orders, placing me in deportation again. Right. And if that is the case, I would be essentially shipped out of the country back to Venezuela and, and to the conditions that my parents fled once. Um, and, you know, if, you know, push come to shove, what would happen, you know, if any of those plans, you know, if Dr. and Dr. were were repealed, placing me in the deportation, and what if Donald Trump became the GOP nominee, the Republican nominee? Would you support him and his plan to deport people like myself out of this country? Well, if you love the United States of America, then you should oppose the DACA and DAPA plan too. And here's why. Because they're unconstitutional. Mm -hmm. There is a process for changing the law. If you want to change the law, there is a process. It can be frustrating. It can be time consuming. But there is a process and it's laid out in the basic construction manual of this country. It's called the Constitution. And if you love this country, then you should not stand for anything that is unconstitutional. You not stand for an executive that tries to write the law himself. It sets a very, very, very dangerous precedent to get behind something that is unconstitutional like that. And here's why. Because you may agree with something that this president has done now, but what about when it's a president that you disagree with? And he tries to use the same unconstitutional executive order to pass a law that you totally disagree with. That's why you should be in, uh, opposed to it, and you should be lobbying your members of Congress, lobbying the White House. I mean, the president said in his first year, in his first term, he was going to tackle immigration. He didn't do anything. He didn't show any leadership. He didn't sit down with the, the, the members of Congress on either party to get something done. 